Um, yep. uh, how are you mate? I'm good, I'm really good, thank you. Um, here, happy to be down here, obviously it's a great opportunity for one of my fighters and, and these are the nights of the culture in it for, you know, in the little title fights and stuff like that. So no, I'm looking forward to it. Brilliant. Just a quick, I'm obviously back to Manchester where your brother fought, I just want a quick yep. uh, assessment of obviously how you thought your brother did as well. Yeah, I thought, I thought he done well, it's like say, a long time out the ring and I thought he done well, he handled the occasion well and he did a, I was a little moment with uh, Steve, Steve Gray and we spoke the next day and I probably apologised as well and he's, he's a good man but no, I thought I've listened for a debut, pressure on my fight box. Well, like you said, he had to deal with that sort of pressure of obviously being given. Of course, that yeah. Reckon that'll help him obviously later on in his career as well, yeah. going through stuff like that. Yeah, of course, little bits of um, I say adversity, but yeah, little bits of um, you know problems in there where so things don't go your way. So yeah, but no, I think it will. And he's, he's been straight back in the gym, and hopefully, then we're going to have him out um, in the next few months. Obviously, James took the fight with Stephen James. Yeah. Um, obviously, when you were obviously thinking of obviously taking the fight, obviously you as a trainer, I probably had a look at Ethan James. Is there many ways? That you think yes, Matt James can go in there and beat Ethan James as a prospect as well? I, I think, yeah, I think Ethan's um, I mean, he's a very good lad, he's got lovely skills, um, great engine on him, moves his feet well. You know, people look into the fact he's not stopped anyone in 11 fights, but him moving from away might actually help him. You know, he's got a good timing, so I'm sure those stops he would have come. But um, no, listen, I, I believe it's a wonderful fight for James. I certainly do listen. He's a big underdog um, with the bookies and everything like that, but I think he's a very live one. I do. If James gets it right, he's in improving all the time, like you see the, the quality sparring that he has, He's, um, he goes out there, carries out the plan that we set out for him, I believe he's got a great chance of doing it on Saturday night, I really do. Obviously James has the experience of going through a defeat, do you reckon that will help him on Friday? Yeah I do, I, I think um, when he, he lost to uh, John McGuire's, I just believe that it was, it was a great learning fight for him and I told him in the long run it would stand him in good stead and I think now on Saturday night he's a much better place mentally, physically and improved massively since that last loss and he's had a few good wins since that loss as well. Are you enjoying also being in the training? Yeah lifestyle? I am, I am, it's uh, you know there's bits of it that saying you're mad but uh, no, it's a fighter like James, um, you know hard work and stuff like that makes it very enjoyable. Last one, uh, what's your thoughts on obviously the main event uh, on Saturday? It's um, listen. It's, it's a great fight, it really is, and I think it's it's the perfect fight for Liam. I think the way he's been handled and developed under um, Queensborough, they've been fantastic. And listen, you you've got to um, you've got to make him favourite on Saturday night. But Jason, just read the tattoo, and I, I love his mindset. I love his mindset, and I, and I believe he's quite confident there. I know Liam was talking a lot, but I think Jason's. He's in a good place there, and he's thinking, no, I've, I've, you've not been nothing I've not seen before. But um, there's no denying him from this, and you've, you've got to make Liam a pretty big favourite. Um, but it's a fight I'm really interested to talk about. Really interested to watch after him after James fights. Top man, cheers for your time, man. Top man, always, man. Top top man. Cheers, top man. All the best. Saturday.